just waking up in our suite here at Apuka Resort and we have to show you something. That's the sky. Guys, that's the sky. And that's fresh snow and there's trees over there. We have a completely glass ceiling here right above our bed and you can see everything. You can see the sky, you can see trees, you can see that it snowed last night a little bit. Quite an amazing view all night long and this morning. We're gonna give you a full tour of this place today but first, time for a little breakfast. You guys, the time has come for us to give you a full tour of our suite. Let's go. Welcome to our cabin. Welcome to the inside of our beautiful cami suite here at the Apuka Resort. This place is so incredible. As you guys know, there is three of us on this trip, so we've got an extra bed right here. We came, they had it all made, ready to go for us, very nice. And there's another bed right in here. So there's two fold-out beds in here. This place sleeps four people. Guys, we can have one more, who's coming? Here is our kitchen area. We've got our nice dining table here. This dining table is bigger than most dining tables I feel like we've had in like Everywhere. actual apartments we've stayed in. Yeah. <laughs> this place is so legit. Windows all around. From the outside, it kind of looks like, what is that weird dome looking thing? And then inside you're like, holy cow. We have legit like, basically a full kitchen here. No oven, but we have a stove top. We got a fridge. You know it's already stocked <laughs> with the goods. We maybe hit a little convenience store last night, loaded up on some sodies. We got dishes. You guys, we got all the goods. We've got our full bathroom right in here. Over here, if you really want to set the mood for some ambiance, got a little fireplace. Ooh, I'm so cold. Oh, my toesy. Oh my gosh. It does Actually, put out heat. Now, Who's ready for the main event? <laughs> I am. I'm very excited. Right up this little spiral staircase is the money maker. Follow me. Watch your head. <laughs> <laughs> this is the master suite. You lay here and you look at, well, really all we've seen is clouds, okay? But on a non-cloudy day, you can see the northern lights, you can see stars, you can see the trees. You guys, this place is so rad. We woke up this morning, we had a light dusting of snow on this. You can still see a little bit of it. This glass is actually heated. It has like a heating element to it to keep the glass from frosting and freezing over, which is so nice because we wanna have a clear night, you know? We gotta have a clear night. Majorly crossing our fingers for a Northern Light sighting. As you guys know, maybe you don't know, Daniel and I were in Iceland a year ago and we actually saw the Northern Lights for the first time in our life. Absolutely incredible. Truly one of the coolest experiences and we're really hoping that we can see them here in Finland with my cute mom while we are staying up at this gorgeous resort. Everyone send good vibes, Northern Lights sighting right here. We're gonna have a party on the bed. <laughs> <laughs> The glass dome is so cool. You could see all your neighbors if you get up high. Hi neighbors! <laughs> we have the frozen lake down there. We're gonna be down there in just a little bit for something really fun. I think <laughs> it's gonna be fun. <laughs> we'll see. But this thing is awesome, guys. We have our alerts on for the Northern Lights so that when we get one, we can get up to our suite here and check them out from our glass I wanna see them the from the dome. And then honestly, I think we all know we're going outside. We're getting the tripod. We're getting the cameras. We're doing all sorts of stuff if we can get that Northern Light sighting. Again, guys, this is the Apuka Resort here just outside of Rovaniemi, Finland. 
Finland, and it is a must do. You have to come visit, especially Apuka Resort. This is one of the best resorts in the area. They have all sorts of different cabins. This is the Cami Suite, like Shell said. They have all sorts of different cabins too. They have smaller, more intimate ones with big glass walls. They have bigger ones for families. And let me say, there are a ton of families Tons. here. Tons, oh my gosh. So many kids, there's so much fun stuff to do. You're gonna see a lot of what they offer in today's video, as well as our next video. It is a must do awesome winter wonderland. Make sure you check out the link in our description. We're going to link Apuka Resort. Check it out for sure and get to Finland. Before we go out in the cold, Apuka has given us a little something to help with it. Keep us warm. This is my nightmare. Oh, this is dope. Try just do it like that. <laughs> I love it. We're wearing these around all day. Oh, mine's upside down. Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> off to our first activity here at Apuka Resort. <laughs> it's gonna be amazing. This is like coming into my mouth when it's I open it. It's gonna be a little hot and cold, if you yeah. will. <laughs> in fact, really, when it's sub-zero weather, guess what we're gonna go do? You're gonna see. You're gonna find out. <laughs> so I wanted to give you a quick update on our goal of hitting 100,000 subscribers <laughs> Are we close? by the end of the year. We're climbing. Thank you guys so much for all the support. A lot of you have been subscribing. A lot of you have been sharing with us with your friends. We had some comments that you brought us a few new subscribers at Thanksgiving dinner. <laughs> Oh, you guys are the best. We love you so much. Absolutely incredible. Do you think we can do it? I think we can do it. I think but we But we need your help. We still need your help. If you've heard us ask for this before, but haven't done it yet, subscribe right now. Get down there, hit the subscribe button, and share this epic video with at least one friend. Just and one. have them That's subscribe as well. That would be monumental and launch us really close to 100K. I think even just today, if, you, if we had a bunch <laughs> of people do that. Everyone could just do that today. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously guys, thank you again so much for all the help, all the support. We're gonna need that support right now as we go do something. <laughs> Really Ready? Ready. <laughs> <laughs> Making our way down there. <laughs> oh. <laughs> to the lakefront, the frozen lakefront. You good? <laughs> cold water. Daniel's making me do it again. No, no one has to do it. We have a wood burning <laughs> sauna right here. It is so warm in there. This thing is out floating on the lake and as you can see behind us, we have a nice big opening in the lake. They have a little pump that's just making the water move so that it doesn't freeze and it's just this tiny little space right here that has stayed not frozen, but they literally have to keep the water moving right here so that it doesn't freeze. This is insane. That's how cold this is. Comment down below who's gonna do it <laughs> who's actually gonna get in the ice I think they all know I think they all know who actually has to get in well it's not me we did it last time <laughs> Guys, we did a polar plunge in Iceland. It was in a stream. It was incredibly cold, but it was not snowy and icy. It wasn't snowy outside, but I feel like it was the same temperature of water that we've done here. It was like here. four or five degrees Celsius. We did one in Helsinki just a few days ago in that the ocean, the and Baltic freezing. Sea. That was like four or five degrees Celsius, but I'm pretty sure that this one is gonna be the coldest one. I don't oh, know why I think sure. that, but. <laughs> The fact that they're ice skating next door, that no, could be No, literally, we have like a family running on the frozen lake they're right next to They're driving trucks on that yeah. frozen lake. Oh my gosh. Yeah. The sun is really warm. The sun is really warm. I this is going to be epic, guys. I cannot wait to do both of these things. I can't wait to do that one. <laughs> they recommend hitting the sauna, warming up your body temperature and all that stuff before plunging into the Arctic water. So that's exactly what we're going to do. Got some extra logs in there. It's going to be nice and toasty. And then coming out here, getting in. We need to heat this place up, guys. We're freezing. I think we need another log in there. Close it up. Oh, man. Oh, yeah. All right, shall we get in here? Steam it up. <laughs> The skin is already tightening. Oh! Ooh, it's warm in here. Oh, I don't like it. 
that's hot. just piping hot. This it feels great. My mom and I had to take our necklaces off because they were, they were burning, burning our skin. It's <laughs> but it's like hard to breathe. I think I'm warm enough. It's time to go get in. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> All right, it's time. Oh crap, it's cold. It's really cold. Polar plunge in the Arctic. This ladder is so icy. <laughs> How is it? Good. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Guys, it's a hot tub. <laughs> His it's voice. Hot. Okay, come back. <laughs> back to the sauna. <laughs> oh, that's cold. <laughs> oh, it's windy. <laughs> Guys, I've already cooled down. <laughs> 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 Are you standing? Yeah, I'm standing. <laughs> I'm coming out. Oh my gosh. Okay, very slippery, okay. very slippery. Okay. <laughs> Step, okay. Step. Step. Oh my gosh. <laughs> We're back in the sauna. And we're sweating. <laughs> I just put like six gallons of water on the rocks and they're like, that's enough, that's enough. It was really funny when we first got here, we were like, this sauna is way too hot. But we've all dipped in there twice now into the icy water outside, which is phenomenal. I think it's I the funniest thing I can't believe we've done it twice and I wanna go again. And we are I can see why again. it's addicting. But now we're adding logs to the stove here. We're pouring tons of water on the rocks, steaming this room up because we just can't get warm enough now. <laughs> We have an audience. They're all in full winter gear walking out on the frozen lake that we're currently swimming in. I know, and they're watching us go into this cutout area of water, just dipping in. They're envious or? Like those were... idiots. This is a very finished activity. You have to do a polar plunge, Arctic plunge when sauna you come Sauna experience. The sauna especially. Yes, you guys, they have three and a half million saunas in the country of Finland, and I think only five million people. That's a lot of saunas. That's that's like more than half their population. <laughs> Almost everyone has their own son. Yeah. <laughs> and we're basically. sharing it with three. <laughs> <laughs> all right, guys, we're all going in for one last dip. Here we go. Oh, don't slip. Out. The wind. Really? Oh, it's so cold. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> I got it. I got it. I got it. You guys, we just finished our sauna polar plunge experience. Full disclosure, I was not excited for this. I just didn't really want to do it. It's so cold here. And I was like, you guys, I'm not getting in that freezing cold water. But I think I got in it like yeah, six um, times. And I did it. I did it. She did it like I don't three know. times. I don't know what you guys commented as to who you thought was going to get oh, in yeah. it. But I know who nobody won? voted for me. I didn't even <laughs> vote for you. <laughs> I thought maybe a foot. She got in it and she's screaming. <laughs> And I swear to you, workers came running down thinking someone was in distress, like falling in the lake. She's like, I'm in! It was awesome, but I could not have done it without your help. I really no, couldn't No, because she fell on top of me. <laughs> I don't know why everybody said it was deep and cold. I didn't feel that way at all. I actually will say, I feel like this one was more enjoyable than the one that we did in Helsinki. And I wonder if it's because I could touch. Like, oh, where is that one? True. Yeah. Like the one in Helsinki was like the ocean. So literally you're in and you're just having to tread water, which would probably keep your body warmer. But I don't know, like that one, I was like, <laughs> like you I couldn't breathe. This one was rigid, but that sauna was so, so hot. hot. Like to the <laughs> point where I thought I was going to pass out and die. <laughs> then coming into this, it just wasn't really that bad. It was the awesome. The coldest part was my toes. My feet are still very cold. Yeah, from walking on this. Yeah, yeah just yeah. from walking along mm -hmm. this, I would say. Oh, I but would so recommend it. You 10 out of 10. It. This Absolutely. was incredible. And the fact that it's like loading out here in the frozen oh, lake no. and we had it all to ourselves. This was so it was cool. awesome. <laughs> we can now call ourselves true fins. fins. What a way to, <laughs> probably not. Sorry for fins. What a way to finish. <laughs> what a way to finish Finland. <laughs> <laughs> that was incredible. Just the first of some epic excursions we're gonna be doing out here at Apuka Resort. This one though may have been a favorite. The sun's going down now. It's starting to get dark out. It's starting to get windy. My fingertips are freezing. My gloves kind of stink. <laughs> <laughs> I say do not enter. 
<laughs> oh man, this place is amazing. <laughs> All right, you guys, we got all warmed up. We showered. I think that I just sat under the hot water forever. I can't even remember if I actually soaped my body. No, just kidding, I did. We got all showered up, all warmed up. Yes, we're wearing the same clothes because we have on all the layers. I'm still wearing all my mom's clothes. This is her coat I have on her sweater. Now we're all ready to go and we're heading to grab some dinner. Yeah, guys, they have a beautiful dining room. They do a buffet breakfast. They have a buffet lunch, which we miss. And they also have a buffet dinner in addition to a ton of like a la carte items you can order. I personally am thinking about trying the buffet. They also have a pizza They've place a down pizza here. Place. Honestly though, I'm blown away by the food. The breakfast buffet this morning was so delicious. Like honestly, it was so good. So I'm thinking the dinner buffet is gonna be even well, better. What if they have pizza? Let's go check it out. You know what, some pizza, that's a tough call. <laughs> Yeah. All right, we opted for the buffet tonight, and it's delicious. We started with the salad portion here. My salad plate got a little out of hand. Little salad and soup. I think this is artichoke. It's so, this food is delicious. Like, I'm blown away at how good this food is. Next up, we'll go for the main courses, which I already forgot what they are. <laughs> Second course, we got some pork tenderloin, fillets, vegetables, ravioli, potato, chicken skewers for the kids, and me, and show. <laughs> this is fantastic. That first course, the salads, the pastas, the soup was incredible. The this soup was 10 out of 10. Very, very good. We just met the chef back there. Nice young man, cooking everything fresh right as we speak. <laughs> Dinner was fantastic. Honestly, the whole day has been absolutely incredible. Truly amazing. Like this place is just like out of a dream, but this isn't the end, you guys. We have such an epic day tomorrow. We honestly cannot wait. Tomorrow's like kind of jam packed with like really cool activities. I know. Some things we've never done before that I am so excited about. Definitely check out the link in the description of Puka Resort here outside of Rovaniemi in Finland. <laughs> Make it your next winter destination. It's definitely awesome around Christmas time. You will not be disappointed. We got a little soup takeaway here for my mom. She said she wasn't hungry and didn't want to go to dinner, so we left her. I think really she just wanted to alone time to get away from us. <laughs> Maybe She's had you. too much of, yeah, probably too much of me. No, I'm just kidding. The soup so was we so grabbed good. Some, the soup we decided was our favorite part of the meal. I know random, but it was so Oh good. So we grabbed her some soup to take home so that she can have a little bit of dinner. We're gonna head back to our amazing suite here. Stare up out of our dome. Hope Hopefully we see some we northern see lights. Light. If we do, we'll see you later in this video. If not, <laughs> we'll see you all tomorrow. Good night everyone.